Еще немножко. Uh, hello. Can I help you? Yes, I'd like a carton of milk and a bag of caramelized onion chips, please. Right away, my friend. Wait a second. I don't sell that kind of stuff, do I? Короче, взгляни на фото. Come on, take a look at this photo. Why? Are you a cop? I um that stuff in the back is not mine. Just look at the damn picture, Mel. Hey, I know that guy. Finally, some progress. Where do you know him from? I think he was here a while ago. Yeah, definitely. Perfect. Yeah. Did he buy anything? Did he say anything? He bought the most powerful revolver there is. Почему у вас все девять тысяч? Nine thousand. And he said something about. Killing some Randall Hicks guy. Yep, that was it. How could you not remember something like that? But who is this Randall Hicks? Did he say where he was going? Well, I guess to that Randall guy's place, right? You know. Dick, dick. <laughs> right? I don't know. Just a guess. Oh, I'm going to the market today. Как я уже делал, кстати, потому что я вижу наперед его действия. Я, я все понимаю. В отличие от Рэндл. Боже. I kill you, Randall. Hello, Randall. It's, It's me, me, Matt. me, Matt. How's that ruining my life thing working out for you? Well, it doesn't really matter anymore. I'll be dead by the time you read this. I admit we've had some great times together, even though you're an idiot. But... Я соврал, я живой. Жду тебя на крыше, у меня есть пушка, не тяни резину со мной. Шесть маленьких дружков, все они гораздо быстрее тебя. Шесть? А, да, потом. Oh, thank God I found you. Please, Matt. I, I, I know what you must be thinking right now, but you gotta let me explain. Look, before you say anything, I am so sorry. You're a fucking bastard. You stole Sally from me right in front of my eyes. And with my own ring. I'm gonna blow you your fucking you. brains out. Matt, it's not what you think. Don't do anything you might regret. I don't think I'll have time to regret it. I'm gonna kill myself right after I kill you. Oh. Um. Oh. Yeah. I can't handle the idea of seeing you two together. God, just the idea of it makes me sick. Oh, Matt, come on, I know you, and if you're feeling nauseous, it's because you're drunk as hell. Why don't we just sit down and talk it out like a couple of buddies? You and me, two buddies. Buddies? How fucking dare you? A buddy wouldn't do what you did to me. Never. No. Well, you know what alcohol does to our brains. No, dude. Throwing flower pots out of the window at people or traumatizing kids for the life is one thing. But stealing your best friend's girl? You play with people's feelings, Randall. Feelings! Do you know what those are? Matt, you know I love you when you get drunk, but you know, I just found out you become really lame when you're drunk and heartbroken. <laughs> Think objectively. What do I gain by stealing Sally from you? Can't you see it makes no sense? I can't think objectively right now. I just want to put an end to this once and for all. Now, you're Ой, да успокойся ты. Right right yeah, like prank, right? on, evil being. Sure you were. Come on, Matt. You and I have been friends forever. Are we really gonna let some tramp ruin all that? Don't call her a tramp. I just meant... I don't care what you meant! I don't want to know! Uh, 
получается. Ничего не получается. Мэтт, я сверю, я не хочу ничего делать с Салли, поверь мне. Well, that's not what it looked like to me when you gave her my ring and proposed. And that was last night! We all drank way too much last night, so why don't we just forget about it, huh? I'll just shoot myself. It's the best way to forget. No, what am I saying? It'll be best if I shoot you. Um... Dude, I don't know what to say. I, I guess I drank too much and I pushed the joke way too far. I, I don't know. I don't even remember. No, dude. I remember it as if it were yesterday. I can't no, forget I you. Помню, How do you expect me to be reasonable with someone like you? Come on, Matt, listen to me. Let me explain, please. Yeah. No, I can't. Yeah. Come on, Matt, let's talk. We both need a little chit-chat. There'll be plenty of time to kill me later. Oh, all right. Just say what you have to say. This is all a joke. You filthy liar! I saw everything with my own eyes! I would never make a move on Sally. Bullshit! I don't believe you! Dude, I don't remember a thing about yesterday. You proposed to Sally with my ring. Right in my face. And she said yes. Yeah, I'm as freaked out as you are. I swear, I just want to fix all this. And how are you gonna do that? All right, you know what? I'm gonna get out of town for a while. And what? Do you really think that you're going out of town is gonna solve anything? I'll talk to Sally. Before or after sleeping with her? Honestly, I, I I have no idea. That's it. Look, I wish there was something else I can say, but I've always really been bad at fixing things. You know, Randall, all this shit fucking blows, but I believe you. So what now? Well, uh, for starters, how about we put that gun away? I swear, I don't want anything with Sally. You have my word. Nah, fuck. I won't back out now. I started a mission, and I will finish it. Ah, I'm tired of this shit. Do what you want. I pass. Shut up, Randall. You're a real big mouth. I am not going anywhere till we sort things out. Well, that won't be an issue once this gun's done its job. Wow, that sounded like Eastwood with a touch of Bronson. Matt, you know how to demand respect, but I know how to multiply decimals. Enough with the talking. Got any last words? I have seen things you people wouldn't <laughs> believe. I... I can't do it. God! Damn it! All right, come on, buddy. Put that thing away. Let's go have a nice little chit chat. I'm obvious. Yep. E. Bzding. No, no, no! This can't be happening! No! Freeze! Boom. Don't you move a muscle, dirtbag! Now your ass belongs to me. What the hell are you doing here? And why does everybody insult me whenever they're pointing a gun at me? Randall Hicks, you're under arrest. What? Why? For the murder of Matthew Griffin. Or are you gonna deny it? I, uh... You know what? Do whatever you want.
Ты куришь? Нет, спасибо, я бросаю. Вот, что -то, что -то. The first days the toughest and no doubts about it. When they put you in that cell, when those bars slam home, that's when you know it's for real. Old life blown away in the blink of an eye. Nothing left but all the time in the world to think about it. And a tape measure in your pocket. Jail? Seriously? Oh, I hate life. Holy <laughs> Ulysses 31. Randall Hicks? You're still alive? So it seems. So you're gonna be my cellmate, huh? This is amazing. The most famous prisoner in here. The one everybody's talking about is none other than good old Randall Hicks. Man, we are gonna have a blast. You just wait. Wait a second. How come I'm so famous? Well, you know, because of what you did. You know. No, mm, I nope. don't. So start talking, Charlie. I'm in no mood for riddles. Oh, relax, man. Those are just rumors. Don't pay any attention to them. We're all innocent here. Sure. I still don't believe this. You and me, cellmates. How many years did you get now? Honestly, I don't know, and I don't care. I won't last a day in here, I'm sure. Well, cheer up, man. It's not that bad. You'll see. You might even come in handy. Oh, don't get your hopes up. I'm not gonna be your stand-in super hot chick love doll. Ah, that won't be necessary. Oh, what is this? Are you digging a tunnel? That depends. Well, I wouldn't mind, yeah. You know I'm not the type that's gonna flourish in a prison environment. Look, if you wanna come with, that's okay. But it'll cost ya. You want out, you gotta earn it. I told you, I'm not gonna be the substitute for your... I said, that's not it. I need a favor. If you take this seriously and help me, I swear to you, we'll get out of here. Okay, uh, what do you need exactly? Well, getting something like this in prison won't be easy. But maybe you can get some help. Uh, come on, spit it out, what is it? Okay, I won't beat around the bush. I need some explosives. Explosives? Who do you think I am, MacGyver? Oh, come on, man. I'm digging the tunnel with my adamantium claws. The walls are weak, so that's not a problem. The thing is that I'm about to reach Sector 7, and it's protected by a reinforced concrete wall. And I'm afraid that up against something like that, my claws are useless. Yeah, speaking of claws, how the hell did you manage to sneak Oops. them in here? Oh, that. Each prisoner is allowed to keep one item that has some sentimental value, as long as you promise not to murder your inmates with it. Ooh, I like that rule. What did you keep? Me? Well, uh, looks like a stupid tape measure, apparently. I would have preferred that Korean portable console, the one with the electric shocks, you know? I see. Well, don't let me hold you up. Go find me some explosives. Ah, oh, come on, Charlie. How am I gonna get explosives in jail? I probably got a better shot at finding a Playboy bunny. Uh, maybe, but as you can see, we're in prison, and I'm digging an escape tunnel with my retractable claws, which are made of adamantium, at least that's what I tell everybody. And if there's anything I've learned from comic books, it's never to give up. Well, that and plagiarizing adamantium claws. Hey, what are you insinuating? Nothing, nothing. Let's go back to that explosives thing. Any idea where I should start? Well, you could try to build them yourself. Or maybe Sleazy can help you out. He's very good at getting all kinds of stuff. Yeah, sorry, but I think I was sick the day they taught us how to build C4 at school. Don't be so negative. I don't know. Just ask around or, or go to the library. Enlighten yourself, Randall, for God's sake. Uh, I'll see what I can do. How did you end up in here anyway? <laughs> I told you, we're all innocent here. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute, what did you just say? No, nothing, nothing. I'm just not sure how to take all this. What do you mean? Well, you see, I got arrested for killing someone. Wow, what did he do? Did he steal something from you? Did he poison you with fish? I don't know, man. It's, it's all kind of a blur. I was hitting the macadamia nut drinks pretty hard, and the next thing you know, I, I ripped the guy to shreds with my claws. So, 
Who was the poor bastard? Do I know him? Better than most. Oh, Matt. man. You Ginzu'd Matt? Homeboy can't get a break from the kitchen utensils. God. I'm not talking about Matt. I'm talking about you. What? Okay, Charlie, you're starting to freak me out here. Easy, dude. I'm not threatening you or anything. I'm not really sure what happened. I was just wasted. But I do remember dismembering that bastard. And I also remember he deserved it. All I'm saying is that the guy looked exactly like you. Now, I know that. In fact, I was sure it was you until I saw you in here. But anyway, let bygones be bygones, right? Uh, yeah. So, what do you guys do for fun around here? Well, not much. I barely leave my cell. But if you want some entertainment, you can try the yard. Maybe they're having a spitting contest. Or, uh, ask the sisters. <laughs> Those guys really like partying and stuff. Great. This is just great. Enjoy <laughs> you. I have a thing we are not in Kansas anymore. Yay. I'll just keep the pillowcase and leave the pillow. I'll just keep the pillowcase and leave the pillow. Psst. Psst. Sure. Randall, go find me some explosives. All right. No time. No. I'd rather talk to people. Кто так? А Мортимер? No time. Morty, is that you? <coughs> what are you doing here? <coughs> no way. How come? Это зомби какой-то из Half-Life. You know what, Comrade Mortimer? Ah, I have no idea what those stupid growls mean. I never did. Just felt like I was missing out on something, to be honest with you. Huh? Morty, you know that me and you could never work out, right? We're from two completely different worlds. Huh? No, shh. Don't say anything. Don't make it harder on me than it has to be. Looks like someone feels more comfortable in the dark. That'll teach her not to complain about my food. <clears throat> Great. I can't get him out. Nah. I can't. What? No way. Did you just see that? I think the. Ah. Um. Wow, there's a detergent tablet in one of the pockets. Nah. Nah. I don't think so. No way, there's a hole. That's not... That's... That's... I don't... I... I better... Ah, that's chronic, isn't it? Boys always go fishing with the first-timers. And they don't quit till they reel someone in. Ай-яй-яй-яй-яй, зачем вы? Зачем вы? Не трогай меня. Не трогай. Бог из сестры. Кухня. I can't get in. Well, good morning, gentlemen. Well, well. What do we have here? Fresh fish? I uh, don't like the sounds of that. No, I'm not fresh fish. Hey guys, looks like we got a live one here. Think you're some kind of hero, kid? Well, hero's a bit much. Let's just say main character. <laughs> That's right, kid. You're the main character of our dreams. Although they'll be more like nightmares to you. 
<laughs> well, at least I hope so. Uh, yeah, I'm on my way to the library, so if you'll excuse me... No way! We're really enjoying your company. Come on. Come closer. You know, at first I really thought you guys were some kind of skinheads or something. But now I realize you guys are very loving people. I mean, I, I respect that, you know, but I prefer the gratifying wisdom that you get from library books. So if you don't mind... Oh, but we do mind. If you want to get in there, first you have to feel our love. But I warn you, we believe in tough love. <laughs> um, well then, uh... I gotta go. Sure about that? Don't you wanna be one of us? From what we've been hearing, you're our type of guy. Straight up monster. Okay, what the hell did you hear? Relax, we're not judging. We just wanna be your friends. You know, you might need some friends in a place like this. Uh, I'm sorry, but I'm not accepting any applications for new friends at the moment. Come on, don't be so uptight. You know, you scratch my back, and I'll scratch yours. And by scratch, you mean... Come on over, I'll explain. You know, I've never really been a curious person, so I'll pass. I'd better get out of here. Wise decision. Um... I wouldn't get too attached to that cat if I were you. What do you mean? You're not thinking about eating him, are you? Well, of course not. What kind of man do you think I am? I don't know. The kind that loves barbecues? How the hell did you know that? It doesn't matter anyway. That cat has been around here for a few years now, and whenever he approaches someone, it's because that someone is about to die. Somehow, that cat has the ability to smell death. Oh, great. Just great. As if dealing with that curse wasn't enough, now I have to deal with the Cat of Doom. Um, oh, that cat re- I'm not touching it. I know my life's not going- Hey, Murray. What's up, prisoner? How you getting along? Uh, can't complain. Things in here are very different, son, so if you want my advice, try to keep your mind busy, just worry about yourself, and stay away from trouble. If you need something to keep you occupied, just talk to me. I'm the one who assigns jobs to prisoners. Hmm, I'll keep that in mind. Trust me, kid. It's better to go by unnoticed. You don't want to attract any attention. I don't think the people in here have much sympathy for you. What do you mean by my kind? Relax, my friend. It's not my job to judge you. But don't think your fellow inmates are going to be as nice to you as I am. Thanks, Murray. You're welcome. So, Murray? Yes? What's that behind you? Ah, oh, that's the shower room. Oh, I see. That's what they talk about in the movies, isn't it? Ooh. Yeah, well, don't believe everything you see on TV. Do you mind if I see the showers? I'd really love to. No, you'll see them when it's shower time. Okay, if you can't show me. Don't you get bored just sitting on that stool all day? Honestly, yes. But a man's gotta do what a man's gotta do. And don't they let you bring anything in here to entertain yourself? Not anymore. We used to be able to read the paper, but then too many accidents started happening. And the warden said there would be far less accidents if the guards started actually watching the inmates. I see. I'll uh, leave you to your work. Okay. То есть, эм, может дать ему газету? Нет, не газету. Okay. I must admit, I didn't think much of Randy first time I laid eyes on him. Looked like a stiff breeze could blow him over. That was my first impression of the man. Hey, kid, come here a second. Did I do something wrong? You're the new guy, right? Well, new guy sounds better than old guy. It depends on the context. To me, 
Old sleazy sounds way better than new corpse in the showers. <laughs> Relax, kid, I'm not dangerous. People here need me, so they don't mess with me. You're the one needs to be watching his back. There are a lot of people in here who don't like your kind. My kind? Yeah, you know. Why you got thrown in here? And why was that? Because it could be anything for all I know. You don't know what you did? Honestly, no. Wow, man, you're even sicker than I thought. I just got goosebumps. And what did I do? Hey, hey, I'm not judging anybody. You can go around mugging people naked at the mall for all I care. Is that why you're here? Eh, uh, touche. Let's get to the point. Yeah, I guess I'm the new guy. Are you the famous sleazy I've heard so much about? Ha, <laughs> well, all good I trust. I hear you can get things for people in here. Your first day here and you need my help already? Come on, kid. One step at a time. I need a hand getting a few things and everybody told me you're my guy. You don't say. And what do you need exactly? I need a lot of things. Getting me the hell out of here is one of them. I can get you anything you want, but I'm afraid you'll have to be a little more specific. So it's that easy? Yeah, but it'll take one day. I can get you anything you want, but not till tomorrow. Oh, don't do this to me. I could even get you a tank. A tank? Yeah, a tank. You want a tank? Uh... What? You don't believe me? No, it's not that. Because I could get you a tank just like that. I, I, I believe you, man. Тогда почему ты не сбежал отсюда? If I tell you I can get you a tank, then tomorrow you'll have your tank. I don't want a stupid tank. Did you just say my tank is stupid? Huh? No, I, I, I just don't need one. Sorry, too late. Order's already been placed. You'll have your <coughs> tank tomorrow. Okay, but I also need other stuff and I need it today. Then I can't help you. Is that all? Yeah, that's all it's taken to really piss me off. Are you chewing on a whole pack of gum or what? Two, actually. Nicotine gum. I'm trying to quit smoking, but I'm not doing very good. This calms me down, sort of. And you should calm down as well. You'll have your tank by tomorrow. Okay. I don't think this... Wow, you too? God, almost all my friends are here. Do I know you, rookie? Sure. I, I mean, uh, I, I don't think so. What is it then, Ruby? Have we met or not? Well, not quite. Let's just say I know Mel. You know, the guy you used to steal from, uh, I mean, you used to be his supplier, right? Ah, good old Mel. Yeah, sure, sure. Did you hear about him? Not really, but the last time I saw him, he was loaded on mercury cola. Well, you were lucky you didn't run into him a little later. Well, I'm in jail, so I don't consider myself all that lucky. But anyway, what happened to Mel? The guy hijacked a train from the Schaefer line. But he was so damn out of it, he derailed the thing. Don't ask me how, but there were a lot of injured, including Mel. The line's still closed. Wow, I used to ride that train every day. Yeah, you know what the best part is? The guy wasn't even armed or nothing. He just put on a Ghostbusters proton pack. Scared the shit out of everybody. That's amazing. So, do you have a moment to talk business? What is it, rookie? I was just wondering if, uh... Nah, I don't think this is for you. Hey, spit it out, dumbass. You see, there are these guys blocking the library entrance, and... Let's just say they've been sort of threatening me a little. So the sisters found a new pet, huh? Looks like old Boggs is at it again. Anyway, why should I give a fuck about that? I don't know. I thought maybe we can help each other out. What do you mean, help each other out? Well, if you watch my back in here just for today, I can tell you a little secret. I'm not interested in your little secrets. Get away from me, kid. You bother me. Oh, come on. Wait, don't be like that. Have you heard about our little escape plan? Escape plan? I must say I haven't. That's because it's a secret. Mm-hmm. And when is it going down? Well, tomorrow. First thing in the morning. It doesn't sound very, uh, believable. But what is the plan, anyway? We're digging a tunnel, and we need some explosives to blow through a wall in Sector 7. You're digging a tunnel? With what? Well, my contact has access to the necessary tools. 
The problem is there's a reinforced concrete wall in Sector 7. That's why I need to go to the library. I have the vain hope of finding some information about homemade explosives. But you can, as long as the sisters are there. Exactly. Okay, Rookie, you've convinced me. Mm -hmm. I'm in. Really? You're not pulling my leg here, are you? Let's see. What do you want me to do? Kill bugs, right? Um. Yep. I'd settle for just being able to get into the library. I'm right behind you. Right now? No way. I'm banned from all the facilities during yard time. There's been the odd, shall we say, altercation. Shit. And what time does that finish? Who knows? Nobody controls nothing in here. Except the guard on the stool. Damn, Murray. Okay, how's this? You walk over to the door and I'll find a way to distract him, okay? Okay, newbie, but be warned. If this is all just a setup and there is no escape plan, I will make your life a living hell in here every fucking day. Do you hear me? Sure, man. I, I would never try and shank you. Okay. Nah, that's okay. Where's the sense in that? What's up, Gruel guy? Hey, this isn't Gruel, and I have a name. Show some respect, rookie. And what's your name? I'm not gonna tell you. Just let me eat in peace. There's a huge guy right behind you, and he doesn't look happy. Mm -hmm. Huh. Excuse me. Hey! How's the gruel? Asshole, I told you this isn't gruel. This is, well, you know, food. Well, there's something in your food. Look, it's moving. Extra protein, then. There's a huge... Oh my god, look at that guy. I have all the time in the world. Why not work on my fitness for a little while? Eh. Hmm? I have all the time. I could see why some of the boys took him for snobby. He had a quiet way about him, a walk and a talk that just wasn't normal around here. He strolled like a kid in a video game store without a care or a worry, like he had on an invisible coat that would shield him from this place. Yes, I think it would be fair to say I liked Randy from the start. Hello, guys. I'm the rookie. Good. You're just the man we need. I'm not sure I'm gonna like this. Ah, uh, relax. You can trust us, rookie. Right, guys? Right. Most of the times. Yeah, whatever. We heard some nasty shit about you, brother. People be talking like you're some kind of all-out monster. That's true. Uh, if that's gonna make life easier in here, then yes, yes it is. I'm the monster. <laughs> well put, monster. And your name is? Hicks. Randall Hicks. Randy the Rookie. I like you, man. Come play with us. We're training for the Interpenitentiary Spinning Contest. Come on, show us what you got. God, again with the Randy. No thanks, I don't feel like it right now. Hey. Whoa! Ah. Randy, Randy, Randy. I didn't say play with us if you want, but you're new in here, so I'll let it pass this once. But now, spit. Okay, here we go. I don't do it. That's it. Tell me that was just a test. That was just a test. That all no. you got? Come on, try again. All right, if you insist. Как-то не похоже на слюну, это больше похоже на то, что он. Oh, come on, even my little sister can do better than that. <laughs> What a wuss. <laughs> you know, Randy, you don't got what it takes. You're gonna have to grow a pair if you want to make it in here. Mm -hmm. Mommy ain't here to hold your hand. 
now. Get lost. I don't want people thinking we're friends. I can't live. I'd rather talk. Oh, wow. I bet these old slab. I don't feel. Pretty ugly guy, all right. Hey, I know you. You were some kind of salesman, weren't you? Um, yeah. I used to be a salesman for Wondermatic Industries. Yeah, whatever. You know, you should tell your bosses their products are really dangerous. Well, that's gonna be a little difficult. I got fired. How come? Well, you know I was going through a rough patch. I couldn't even sell a damn stapler. I was gonna lose my house, and I was up to my eyeballs in debt. But then, I managed to make the greatest sale of the century. The kind of sale every salesman dreams of. A sale no. so good it would impress death himself. Hmm, sounds good. Yeah, well, I talked this poor guy into buying almost the whole catalog, but... But? One of my supervisors found out and robbed the sale. Get out? What did you do then? I went to his office and killed him. No shit. Uh, between you and me? That's not exactly how it happened. You know, people tend to exaggerate. In fact, I barely touched him. His tie got stuck in the shredder. You can't imagine the blood. Oh, I can, believe me. By the way, that shredder? From the Wondermatic line, I'll bet. Yes. Well, now that I think of it, you're right. Those products are kind of dangerous. So, what do you think of this place? Well, it's not so bad once you get used to it. It's a little tough at first, though. They always go after the new guys. You don't <laughs> say. Uh, they'll forget about you eventually. If you want a tip, try not to attract any unnecessary Ну почему я не должен привлекать никого? То есть я понимаю, как бы. Мыло продвигает, так скажем. That's true. People are saying some very ugly things. Это какие? What things? Come on, don't torture yourself. You should just forget about it, or else it's going to be very hard for you. Uh, you can't imagine how right you are, my friend. Do you know anything about homemade explosives? Explosives? Not really, but you never know. Well, I don't. And do you really think you should be playing around with explosives? No, oh, well, they're not for me. They're for a friend. Yeah, sure they are. Do you know anyone that can help me? With your reputation, I don't think there's many people in here who'd talk to you, much less help you. Not all of them are like me, you know. Although... Although? Maybe you could go ask Sleazy. That guy can get you anything. That's what I've heard. Do you know these guys called the Sisters? Sure. They're pretty famous around here. But they're not really as friendly as they say. Yeah, well, uh, that's sort of a given, isn't it? Believe me, you don't want them as friends. Oh, I believe you. It's just that I wanted to go to the library, but those guys are right there standing guard in front of the door. I can't get in. Then don't. Uh, that's plan B. But the thing is, there doesn't seem to be anything better to do around here, and I'm starting to really feel the need to read a nice book. I know what you mean, and you know what? I'm gonna help you, rookie. But remember, you're gonna owe me one. Yeah, sure. The sisters use some sort of code between them, a password. A password? Yeah, it's a sentence they use. If you say it when you're with them, they'll have to let you through. And how do you know that? Let's just say we did some business together for a while. I don't want to know about it. So what's this password? Go talk to them and repeat these words. Klatu, Barada, Niktu. That sounds familiar. Repeat them. Klatu, Barada, Niktu. One more time. I've got it, I've got it. I know the damn words already. What do you think, I'm a moron? Thanks, I owe you one. Well, take care. See you, rookie. I want to sp- Inakis. <laughs> Is that it? Man, you just get worse every time. Motherfucker.
I just don't know what I'm doing wrong. Hey, don't give up, rookie. No one is born an expert. If you knew the things I'd seen since I came here... Hey, remember that dude used to drink buttermilk to make his spit thicker? What was his name? That was Johnny. Johnny Knives. <laughs> That's it. That bastard managed to break a couple of records back in the day. And what about Lester? That guy was a math genius. Boy, did he know how to <laughs> use that to help him spit. Hold on. He used math to help him spit? Hey, rookie, spitting is not that simple, you know. Sometimes you gotta use your head a little. That guy even managed to use the Coriolis effect to his own benefit. And he managed to beat old Bradley's record. Yeah, <laughs> that really was supreme competition at its finest. To the beast. I'm not gonna put my hands. Why the hell? Ah, the mock fuck. I better not. A shock. I'm not gonna put. That's not gonna... I like people to call me Mr. Fantastic, but that doesn't mean I am him. Почему она ставила рулетку? Именно рулетку, не, не в сущности утку свою, а рулетку. him uh, I better I don't want to be f I bet I'm not. 
Uh, sorry. What now, fishy? Okay, I'll say the words. What are you talking about? Platu Barata Necktie? Nectarine. Nickel. Oh, come on. What was that last word? I know there was an N word. What was Nikto. that damn last word? Nikto. Nikto. That's it. Platu Barata Nikto. There, I said it. Now make way, people. The library awaits. What's your problem? What are you trying to do? Deactivate us? Because you're starting to piss me off here. I thought that was the password. The, <laughs> the password? <laughs> I think someone's been pulling your leg, rookie. You'll be the laughing stock in here. Bastards. You want revenge? Yes. Yes, I do. You want to make it clear that no one fucks with the newbie? Of course. Would you like to make it to Tuesday Alive? Hell yes, come on, where do I sign? Come to the laundry and I'll show you the <laughs> contract. But I warn you, if you bite, I'll break your teeth. And you can call me Gord if you like. Okay, I see where you're going with this and uh, I think I'll pass. Oh, come on now. You can't leave me hanging like this. I got my hopes up. The least you can do is give me a little kiss. A kiss? Uh-uh. I don't want any weird stuff. I'm out of here. A kiss. See ya. Keep on your toes. You just never know in here. No, no, Good no, no, no. morning. My name is Randall. Are you the new sous chef? No, I'm just here. Then get the hell out of my kitchen, insect. But I, I just wanted to... Don't make me repeat myself, or I will rip your legs off. Okay, okay, jeez. Looks like Bruno doesn't want me in his kitchen. I'll need a really... Ugh, that... Нет, сначала я пойду отомщу. Если это возможно, конечно. Скажу, какой ну урыт тупый, блин. Эй, look who's back. If it ain't our friend Randy. Did you meet Boggs already? Did he show you his Necronomicon? <laughs> no, and he didn't show me his ash neither. Oh yeah? Cause a little bird told me you guys already became good pals. <laughs> hey, I just got a little Charlie horse. I didn't even touch the guy. Do you hear that, guys? The rookie. <laughs> <laughs> what can I say? I'm not into that. Hey, relax, rookie. We was just kidding. We don't give a damn about Boggs or which side he butters his muffin. God, that fucking asshole Matic played me. Hey, shithead. He's one of us. Show some respect. One of you? You must be fucking kidding me. What did that chump ever do? Well, he used the quote from last week's movie to set up some poor idiot rookie. <laughs> huh. So that's how you play, huh? Hey, look on the bright side, kid. At least you gave us all a big laugh. You bullshit salesman. This isn't over. Relax, buddy. It was just a joke. Oh, you're on my list now. You know where to find me, rookie. You better stay away from our new friend, or a night with Boggs in the laundry is gonna feel like a prom date compared to what we'll do to you. <laughs> <laughs> hmm, how's that spitting contest thing going? Well, we're just waiting for the cook. The cook? Bruno, the cook. He's one of this year's favorites. Why do you call him the cook? Because he's the cook. Oh, okay. 
I thought that was just a nickname or something. So, uh, how's the food here? Is it as bad as they say? Here's a free tip before you get into any trouble. In here, you are worth nothing unless there's something you can do for people. You know, Sleazy, that guy can get you anything you need. My point is, if you have nothing to offer, then nobody will give a damn about your rookie ass. I see. Bruno is the cook here, and if he finds out you've been bad mouthing his food, you. Почему? Почему? Получу же по жопе. And who you say it to? Gotcha. Smart kid. And now, how about another try? Mm, nope. Как вот и веревка из двух. I'm not gonna do. Что мне это дает, что я веревку сделал? His father made him eat his hamsters as a punishment for not cleaning his room. Are you serious? I'm always serious. That's when his wickedness was born. And also his passion for cooking. Amazing, but you know what? It turns out I'm a cooking enthusiast myself. Are you implying that you'd like to work in the kitchen? Well, uh, yep. I wouldn't mind. I'm sure there must be a lot of cool stuff in there I can combine in my inventory or something. Uh, I'm sorry? Uh, oh, nothing. Very well. I name you the new temporary sous chef. Tell Bruno you're his new helper and show him how good you are. Thanks, Murray. I'm gonna give it my all. I'll uh, leave you to your work. Okay. 